Hello everyone, today I'm going to explain how to clip your image in Earth Engine for, for country boundary layer and uh, without importing any shape file, basically by using the predefined uh, layers inside the Google Earth Engine. So what I'm going to do is just simply type here. Let, let me first show my satellite image to you. So this is modest land surface temperature and as you know modest uh, images are mosaic in our engine for the entire world so let's just quickly run this piece of code and there it is so th this is land surface temperature for for this date in 20 2021 and um, but I don't need it for for the entire world I just want to clip it for one specific region in our case I, I just want to clip it for Iran this country so I'm going to find whether we can we can get a shape file inside the Earth Engine for each country. So I'm just going to simply type countries here, and um, as you can see, there is table, and there it is. So we have an FAO layer for global administrative unit and country boundaries. So let's just click on this, and as you can see, it has it. It has shape file for each country, and this is a table. And um, here we have different columns of this table. And the first one is admin code. Admin code for each country. So what I'm going to do is just first adding this layer and then filter based on the admin code. So let let me first import. So I just import this table. Let me name it countries. Okay. And then, okay, what was the name? The name was Fogo. Okay. I'm going to find the admin code for Iran. For our case, you can find it for other countries. So let me just quickly search this. Okay. Yeah, country code. Let me f see if we have a table or something. Okay, there it is. We have a table. And and this one is showing the country admin code, admin zero code. So let me find Iran. Okay, here is Iran and the admin code is 117. So I just simply copy this and uh, go back to our code. So what I'm going to do here is um, I'm going to filter this collection based on the admin code. So I'm going to define a new variable, call it, let's say, country. And then I'm going to uh, filter countries uh, based, on, uh, based on the admin code. What I'm going to do is to add a equal filter so let me see here what filter we have okay so okay this one so this is this is equal filter and look at look at the uh, syntax for the filter so you filter based on a metadata so you give the property name and the value that is going to compare against that property name. So we are basically going to look up the country code, which for our case is 117 in, in, in the property that we specify. The property name is admin zero code, uh, if you remember. So I'm going to use this one. So this is, yeah, equal. For the first one, I, I should provide the prop property name. So let's quickly go to this one again and copy this okay and I'm going to paste it here okay admin code and and then I should provide the number for 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 admin zero code for my country which is 117 and there it is let me add a semicolon and just print this new variable that we created. It is country. Okay. So 
let's let's run the code for now again and look at the variable that we created okay one one property uh let's see uh features okay th we have one feature and let's see if it, this is iran or not and as you can see admin code is 117 and this is iran islamic republic so yeah it's correct so uh the next step would be let me just simply plot this one and comment the rest of the code so uh let's let's plot i just copy this line so I, i'm going to add to plot country and name 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 it iran in my map let's do it quickly yeah there it is it, it find iran let's zoom in a bit okay and uh let me uncomment the rest of the code so all i need to do is this one is calculating lsd based on modis land surface temperature and here i'm uh, multiplying the scale factor and subtracting the offset so the only thing that i need to do is to just clip this lst layer and that's really simple you just need to uh, write that clip and then provide the region that you want to clip and the region for us is country so i just simply put country here so now uh, my LSD layer would be clip for country. And here I'm going to plot LSD again. So I just clip, clip the LSD and here the clipped image will be printed. Let's, let's rename this one to clipped LSD and paste it here. There you go. Let's run the code again okay that's where, okay there you go you can see that we beautifully let me fully screen this uh, we have a land surface temperature clipped for Iran using using the admin uh, table admin boundary uh, boundaries of FAO for each country and you can use your choose your own country admin code and uh, do the same for your own case thank you i i hope that this was this tutorial was useful for you see you